Despite having finally assented to allowing his administration to cooperate with the transition of power to President-elect Joe Biden, President Trump on Sunday continued to spout baseless voter fraud claims in his first interview since Election Day, including suggesting that the FBI and Department of Justice were involved in rigging the election against him. The heads of both the FBI and DOJ were picked by President Trump. FBI Director Christopher Wray was appointed by the president in 2017, while Attorney General William Barr was nominated in late 2018. Barr has been criticized for actions that have been perceived as overly partisan toward the president, including recently clearing the DOJ to investigate voting irregularities before the results are certified, a reversal of long-standing guidance to avoid the appearance of federal intervention in elections that prompted the head of the department's election crimes branch Richard Pilger to step down from his position in protest. Almost all of the dozens of lawsuits filed by the Trump campaign in battleground states have been dismissed by judges, including GOP appointees. However, on Sunday morning, Trump claimed, we're trying to put the evidence in and the judges won't allow us to do it. Trump and GSA authorize Biden to begin presidential transition, Forbes DOJ prosecutors say Barr's authorization of voter fraud probes is, not based in fact, Forbes.